<laughs> How much is this one? Fourteen thousand. We were just driving down the freeway on the way up north. We found these military trucks. There's a bunch of them. There's one there, one there. He's always the one, one. So I'm gonna go. Uh, we're gonna go look at him and uh, maybe one day buy him. He's always wanted one. But these things are sick. Look at this thing. This one's only 7,500 for this huge truck right here. This thing's sick. I always wanted a military truck. Oh, oh yeah. Can you guys see? That's pretty nice side. State of the art technology right there. These things are huge. I like it, I like it, I like it. This one there, this Hummer one's really, really nice. I like it a lot, it's sweet. How much is this one? 14,000? Why is this one way more? I like these ones a lot more, these sick. What? You put like 20 dudes in the back. How are you close to these? Yeah, pull it. Oh. 20 dudes in the back? Can you see? It's just like a flat bed, little two benches on the side. Yeah, that one's pretty cool. This one would be sweet for like off roading. 3,200. Let's get this one. I don't know, this, this one's a little too stock. Bronco? What's it like under there? Military action. This one's not bad. Jump on it. See how heavy duty it is. Yeah. Not very. <laughs> this is more us right here. Yeah, I love that Hummer one. That Hummer one's sick. I don't know. This one doesn't have a price tag. Okay. than the rat rod. Yeah. Wooden bed. What kind of truck is it? Is it a Jeep? I know they made these kind of trucks. Say. I wonder what it is. There's stuff on the other deck. That's sticky, yeah. Say? Ford. Ford. Hell. I like that Hummer. Military crates, bunkers. I don't. That truck's pretty sick. I don't like the back. You can just get like a cap for it. That's probably what they are. Well, it's just like a truck bed, so I guess you can move it off, right? Yeah. And then people can get the bag? <laughs> that one's pretty nice. I like the brown one. We can always get new ones. That one over there is really cheap. Just got back to the cabin and uh, just drove back and this trailer is Mate and right there. 
we were looking at those military trucks that look pretty nice. 14000 for that Hummer. So that's kind of uh, on the pricey side. But maybe one day we'll have a Hummer on this channel. And uh, so we're just going to mess around fix the jet ski. The jet ski's broken over there. So we're going to fix that. Do some other stuff in the garage. And uh, tomorrow I'm going to Baja. We came up here because uh, I left my chest protector neck brace in the garage or somewhere up here. So we're going to get that Sunday go to Baja Acres in uh, Millington, Michigan, and practice there. Hopefully it's not raining, it's raining right now. But we're gonna unload, get all the food and stuff inside, and uh, start having some fun. Turn the lights on and start having some fun. Got the golf cart, and I might rip this YZ out later. And I uh, got my KX in the trailer, and might rip that in the trails. And when we were out, I picked up some uh, spark plugs for my KX85, BRDES, and some AMS oil. I change my oil and spark plug every time I ride it, and uh, like every time I race it at the track, just to stay safe and clean the motor and keep it up. But these are the oils I run right here, and spark plugs. Found my chest protector and neck brace right here. It's nothing serious, but this is it, just Thor. And this little and this neck brace, it was behind the four wheeler right here with that box front, so you couldn't see it when we left, but found it, so now I'm gonna feel safe at Baja. Got on the jet ski now, we snapped the bolt off, or the bolt got snapped in the manifold right there. He drilled a little pilot hole right there, and now he's gonna try to drill it out. He got one of those out, so we just gotta get this one, got a new bolt, and she's running. get that bolt out out of the jet ski sadly but we're gonna head to this store this hardware store called do it best lumber and uh do it. <laughs> that's that's what i used to call it but we're gonna get some uh, tape for the roof right here it's leaking and i'm taking driver's training so i'm gonna drive this nice big ford f 250 super duty down this dirt road just drive around a little bit to give some practicing and head to a couple stores and maybe eat dinner out at this nice food place and uh I'm gonna bring you guys along. Didn't have any bricks or anything, but just like got a nice beautiful dirt bike stand for a little trailer stand. But she's a beaut. But let's hop in this Ford F-250. So high to get up. Damn. Make sure you subscribe. Nice beautiful sticker right here. Subscribe, camera burn on YouTube. What a beautiful sticker. Get yourself a sticker. Only one dollar. Driving this monster truck. <laughs> it's a scary kind of. Ford F-250. Whoa. A little gassy. Yeah, <laughs> torquey. You look behind you? Yeah, there's no one. There's no one. Can you even see out of that one? Whoa. We're sliding, we're sliding, we're sliding. <laughs> it's muddy back here. Stop. Say slam on it. Oh, yeah. Right. Four wheel. All right. Oh, four wheel high. Four by four shifting right. Four wheel high. First time in four wheel? Yeah. Well, it's a little muddy. Driving on the wrong side of the road. Get on your side, son. Why is it so muddy? It's pretty deep. It's really muddy. It's not bad, not bad. We got a hands on 12 and 9. 12 and 9, I don't know. I'm trying to hit puddles. Okay, we're not mud bogging. You got to have a big truck like this. Wonderful making up that little part right there. They got something in front of there. Deer? What stuff up there? Is that two dogs? What is it? Tires? Is that airbags? Oh. Plants? What did they do? That's weird. You know that what? tire for driving up there or something? Dropping tires? Illegal? Doing like 17. What's the speed limit? 40? 
he's down here. I don't know. Probably 55. Watch for deer. 20. 20 around the curve. I'm really pushing on the gas going for him. There's a trailhead. Going on that next. That wide open one. Times on motocross, so yeah, <laughs> takes a little bit longer. Are you, are you giving a guess? No, I'm not. It's crazy. Are you using a right foot? Yeah, be bold. How do you like the truck? It's better than the Chrysler if you want. Control, feel the control. It's slippery out. Only the rat road is a seizing drive. This don't we should go down. Mirrors need to push those things in. Oh my head. Uh, slipping, slipping. Look at that small puddle. That's the one on the left. <laughs> that was a tsunami. Uh, it's a long road. Gonna fit in One this? lane bridge. Gonna watch the mirrors. The watch the mirrors. mirrors. Watch those signs. Plenty of room. Plenty. Oh, that's a little baby puddle. Their mail's wet. <sighs> Sleeping and driving? Get a nice three man slingshot. That looks pretty funny. Do some funny pranks at this. 23 bucks. That's sick. Just got what we need at Do It Best Lumber. See this? See this? See this? See this? Oh, reverse. Got some uh, nice popcorn. So, uh, head back. We might get some CDs or something stupid like that from uh, one of these little knickknack stores and then had to eat and maybe Power Sport Place. Don't forget to like this video. If you want more money videos, maybe you can get a torque truck soon. Yeah, then subscribe. Peace.